Well, two of the most riveting minutes in political <laughs> history occurred on Wednesday night when that fly landed and then stayed on Mike Pence's head. It was amazing. Two minutes. Well, now time for two of the most riveting minutes in television history. We like to call it the Family Physicians Group Plays of the Week. Let's talk about last week's winner first. Jones Tigers had 62 votes on social media, mostly on Twitter. One more than Oviedo, so it's Tyson Robbins to his ace in the hole. Ace on Cobb. No pot of gold on the end of that rainbow, but there was a touchdown. Tigers won that game, and they take the title for the Precision Play of the Week. All right, let's put three new challengers on the board. Play number one this week starts with the sack, and the ball bounces right to Jalen Verser. Easiest touchdown of his career. Part of a brilliant performance by the Bishop Moore defense tonight. Play number two from Wakaiva and Dr. Phillips. Like my wife's overdrawn credit card, Louis Jackson denied. And Achilles Sumter ready to cash in on the other end. Wakaiva jumped out to a 12-0 lead, but it's Dr. Phillips who's going to the bank with the W. They came back to win at 28-19. Play number three, Seminoles' Keon Holloway teaching us all how to break tackles. Step one, don't get tackled. Repeat five times, run to the end zone. A 30-yard touchdown drop for Holloway. We will post these highlights on social media this weekend. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Feel free to vote on all of them many, many times. Yeah, we don't care. All right, Allen High School in Allen, Texas, claims to have the largest marching band in the country with more than 800 members. Eastridge has slightly fewer than that, but still enough to compete in the precision battle of the bands.